Hi, Mom. Hi, honey. Hey, um, I know you don't have a computer, but uh, I'm getting torn up uh, online by, like, powerful elected female politicians. They're calling me. <laughs> I'm sorry. What are you sorry, laughing but... at? Huh? What are you laughing at? <laughs> because, I, because I think they're... I, I, I don't know if I should say that to you. Go ahead. But I think most of these elected, quote-unquote, women stand in the majority if they can't define what a woman is and yet when it, it suits their needs they claim it i'm sorry <laughs> well not to, not to worry i i might have called them a bad word and you know when Ooh. i when i was growing up and i called you a bad word you put soap in my mouth or spanked me with a wooden spoon i mean what do well, you i have to tell you if, if I, I could correct you uh, if, if you did those things it was not to my face. I, I would have to say, uh, growing up, you're pretty respectful. Well, I appreciate I that, Mom. You, you know, I mean, I feel I was raised by a strong woman, and you know, I I think I know how to hang out with strong women because of you. But um, you know, you want to know what I said? Sure, it's bothering you. Yeah, I would like to. I said, I'll see you next Tuesday. Okay. That's a euphemism for um, cunt. Oh, never liked that word. Mm. But um, yeah. hey, in the grand scheme of things, look, look at the language we use now. So that means what? It's another four-letter word, yeah? Yeah. I, I call guys cunts, too. Yeah, it's, uh, I'm not quite sure. I, I don't like manufactured rage. It, it kind of diminishes the real stuff. I mean, isn't it like if if you're lousy at what you do, you're lousy at what you do, and it doesn't matter what's in your pants? I think I said that earlier, honey, but I have a way of going in circles and circles. Yeah, um, sometimes you get there because you like the tag woman, right? And then you get up there and you want to play with the big boys. And uh, your merit is the fact that you, you fob the fact you're a woman. Well, you can be a woman and very ill-qualified, just like men. Uh, you want to play with the big boys and take the falls that they do. And as a matter of fact, I have heard men referred to in very, very disparaging ways um, that would make the cunt word uh, look like another four-letter word that's very nice. I, I just don't care for this stuff, honey, and, and, and I'm truly at my age just sick and damn tired of it. You are a good man. You have always been very kind to me and very respectful from the time you were young, and I'm sure behind my back, like most kids, um, not so much. <clears throat> but uh, that's, a, that's a different story. No, you're a good man. Appreciate you saying that, Mom. So I guess. No, I sound like a typical mother, but you are a very good man, Charlie. And you have taken very good care of me through the years. And I, I am very grateful. And I appreciate your endorsement, Mom. And I love you. And in the name of the family, I'm not going to apologize. Fuck them. Well, you must do what you feel is adequate, honey, and find your own reasons for doing it. I'm sorry. This is one I, I, I don't like it. It irritates, sometimes angers me. Uh, you have to do what you feel is right, but I, I quite frankly think that uh, they like to throw up the tempest in a teapot, and it just depends on do you want to drink their tea. Nah, I don't. Okay, Mom, I love you. I'll see you for Thanksgiving. I love you, my son. Stay home and stay put. It's a holiday, and just eat a lot of turkey and watch TV. I hate turkey. You know that. I'm not fond of it either, but nonetheless, um, eat a lot of stuffing. Remember, we were so broke growing up, like, uh, you used the bed crumbs for the stuffing, remember? I did what? <laughs> Bye, Mom. Goodbye, sweetheart.